Amsterdam, as most people know it, with lots of bicycles. If you look at this situation, cycling seems to be king. But this too is Amsterdam. Multiple lanes for motor traffic, right in the city center. In fact, this is one of the first things people see when they exit Amsterdam's central station. The cars really get a lot of space, while most people, walking and cycling, only get the space that's left at the edges, making it a very unattractive first impression. Cycling does get some much needed space at several locations on the station island. And the intersections are designed to handle a lot of cycling well. But it is strange that far fewer people in large motor vehicles get most of the space. At least drivers know how to behave when they need to give priority to people. But with this volume of people walking, compared to motor vehicles, it is clear the area is designed all wrong. And just a few vehicles can obstruct so many people. Clearly, this has to be changed. And the good news is, the entire station island will be changed. All these motor vehicles will have to use a new route in the near future. The reconstruction has already started. A completely new road, partly in a tunnel, was built behind the railway station. So this area, in front of the station, can become almost car-free in the next years. So what you see here is really the before situation of a major reconstruction. Most of the space available here will go to people walking and cycling. They will have to share the space with trams, but that seems to be possible. At this location, one lane for motor traffic will remain, so deliveries can still take place. People will get most of the space, which is really very needed, because people walking really have far too little space now. This is especially clear when tourist buses stop alongside cycleways. There is almost no space for people to board the buses. And even though the cycleways are clearly marked, tourists, who are not used to such heavy cycle traffic, have a hard time crossing these cycleways. The buses will still be stopping at this location. But with the cycleways further away, it should be a good improvement. With all the motor traffic gone from this area, it will look completely different. People who arrive by train in Amsterdam will get a totally new first impression. The images of today show that that is much needed. <laughs>